the uh, level engine is still here. Offer some more of Mega Man 29th Anniversary Edition. So, last I remembered, I was trying to get some more exits. I'm trying to go for 100% in this hack, which would involve getting all the exits. I left a bunch of them uncleared. Didn't think that I'd get at least two beeples asking me to do this 100%, so I figured, well, two people said go to 100%, one person said pick up a different hack. I've already picked up two quick ones, so I figured, let's try and finish this one. So yeah, Zidane, remember that football player? Also, soccer. I mean, in the UK, they call soccer football. I mean, it makes sense you, you, you use your feet in that game to kick the ball around. I mean, it makes sense, the name's accurate. So yeah, soccer, football, whatever you want to call it. That actually, that headbutt moment actually took place during the World Cup. I can't believe it. And it's been a decade since that happened. Hey, let me guess, I've gone in a loop again. Wow. Okay, I have a piece which I'm gonna use it. Yeah, that was during the World Cup. One of the players on Team France headbutts one of the players on Team Italy. The guy on Zidane gets the red card. Like, they just... He just gets disqualified. And his team was pretty much screwed. <laughs> they lost the player, so... <laughs> Is that the secret exit? that I already got. No, it's a door. No, it's an exit! Okay. The more I know. I already got that exit. Now I need to find the normal one. Okay. <laughs> that was easy. Midpoint, and now we should be on the right track for the normal exit. Probably gonna have to find another door, maybe two. Just waiting for this boo ring again. Right now, there's two doors. Which one do I pick? I'll take this one. P switch. That's something. Hit this and go in this door, I guess. Which leads to, uh. Have I been here before? I wonder if I went the right way. Okay, I didn't backtrack by the looks of it. And now we have the normal exit that I was supposed to find. Coconut Canyon one, which has two exits. I'm ready. Yeah, I played this during the, the first time I played the demo, which was Three Worlds, so yeah, I obviously got this. Again, I, I haven't played it in a while until, like, right now. Because I just skipped by it until beating the final boss. I mean, I actually kind of rushed the first Three Worlds just for the sake of getting to the new content as soon as possible. That way it would get more exciting sooner. Uh oh, there goes Yoshi. Fight. I don't need that mushroom, so I won't take. Alright then, midpoint. Yay, another Yoshi! If I remembered correctly, does the secret exit in this high level have to do with the Yoshi? Where you have to find a blue shell and then fly Yoshi somewhere where you can't...
can't get to without them. Well, I need to find the blue shell. Maybe, okay, maybe it was earlier in the level. And I've already passed up that opportunity. It was probably earlier in the level. Maybe. I don't remember. I'll have to play this level. Yeah. It was earlier in the level. I'm done now with the normal exit. Alright. Gotta go open up Cook in the Canyon 2, even though I've already done that a long time ago. Oh, I have to get my Yoshi back. That should be no problem, really. Alright, Blue Koopa. I'm gonna fly down here and... Yup, there's something. There's the exit. Yeah, now it's starting to come back to me. This was a vertical section here. Alright, that thing doesn't die to fire. And there's a secret exit. I don't know how long it's gonna take me to get all the remaining exits. Well, I'm still in World 2 and getting those exits, so that's still gonna be pretty quick. Because the difficulty is gonna be like really low. Okay, so I've linked World 2 to World 7. That's gonna be really good if I want to travel across the game quickly. And, yeah, I think I got the secret exit in Sunset Canyon already, so I'm gonna have to go and get the normal exit. And this background looks beautiful. In case you don't already know that. Bro, you're not gonna get me. Little bridge here. Okay, we've got a little lag. Jump around that and clear it. Not bad. And now I've linked Worlds 2 to World 5. It's also nice. Canyon Athletics. Auto scrolling levels don't have checkpoints, making these levels a bit hard. Again, there's no comma separating the two sentences, because that kind of. Okay, yeah, it's auto scrolling. Because that kind of was one sentence right there. Just saying. Not trying to be a grammar Nazi here, but. 
That sounds more, more like one sentence than it does two. These levels don't have checkpoints, making those levels a bit hard. Yeah, that's all good. Spin jump, spin jump. Ooh, it's getting dark out, yay. Fun. Really, I wish I could be just running through this level faster. Yeah, I mean, I've... Yeah, it's, I'm still in the first three worlds, so chances are I've played all these before anyway. Now I just gotta do them again. Because maybe something changed. I doubt it. I mean, it's still a nice level, really, but... A little slow pace for someone who's trying to speedrun the rest of the exits. Okay. I guess not. I feel like just going back to that special zone for the sake of doing something more interesting and just getting exits in the earlier stages. I might do that. After I complete this level anyway. I might just get some more of the special zone stuff done. I'm still not sure who that guy is on the overall map for the special zone anyway. I think he has something to do with Capcom, I'm just gonna guess. Maybe he's the producer of Mega Man, I don't know. Ending! I have all the secret exits from worlds 1 and 2 now. So those first two worlds are pretty much complete by the looks of it. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go back here again. Oh wait, this one has two exits. So let's try this again. Now that I know the level's layout a bit better. And I'm not gonna try and speed run this. Okay, so he shoots two when I want to shoot one, I see. Okay, never mind, there was one power up that you didn't need a switch or something to get to. Okay, I'm still running at these things before I see them. Maybe I should give the game time to scroll the screen upwards, so that that doesn't happen again. Oh, come on! I knew the Fire Brother was gonna break my fall. Alright, that was quick. Not too many enemies when you go down there, so... You don't have a lot to dodge and you just fall down. You can just fall down quick enough and chances are you won't hit anything. If you know what you're doing, if you're quick enough. Oh, go now. Okay, I probably should have hit the green switch. Because now I have to fight a boss. Oh, I have to fight Top Man again. I fought him already! If this is the same top man of- yep. Yeah, I fought this guy already. In like, World 7. It's still a tough boss if you're not familiar with the patterns. If you are, then it's a lot easier. And good thing I got that power up. These things just fly so fast that you gotta be familiar with the boss or you're, you're gonna like get hit for sure. Now I'm wondering how many hits he takes, like three or four. Just stop shooting top so I can hit you. Three. Okay, he's dead. Not too bad. 
Especially considering how you have the Super Mario 3 power down, where you power down from cape or fire to big and not just straight to small. So that gives you like quite a few hits extra. Wiggler Desert. Who is that? I want to know. I think he has something to do with Mega Man. I mean, considering we're playing Mega Man 29th Anniversary Edition, I'd be so surprised if he didn't. Alright, now I have this pretty Egyptian sounding theme. And those hopping bricks that are actually Micro Goombas hiding underneath bigger bricks from Super Mario Bros. 3. And he jumped. Is there anything the Firebro can't do? to screw me over. But right, this time I'm gonna get you. Yeah, we get our power up. So yeah, desert. Still doesn't look too hard. Looks like a pretty flat level, but there's a lot of enemies, so it's gonna keep you busy. Even things like hopping flames. Yeah, those will keep you busy. Ooh, okay, pipe. Level has two exits, so I think there's gonna be something maybe hidden in here. But I'd have to find a piece with or something. And I'm guessing it's gonna be in some of these pyramid formation bricks. Or brick formation pyramids. I got those words mixed up, sorry. It's probably gonna be somewhere around there, I can guess. Just a coin. It came back, of course. So there's gonna be a piece switch hidden somewhere in the level, I guess, and then that's gonna make some blocks appear so you can go on that green pipe, right? And those fireballs travel pretty damn far. Look, look at them! That thing can hit you from like a mile away! Oh man, when there's two of them, God help you. Either that or you should have gotten those switches. Uh oh, Chin Chomp, of course he's gonna get me! So damn fast! Okay, I actually got by those without taking a hit. And I still gotta get by the Chain Chomp. It's gonna be tough. You really have to go quick. So quick that you're faster than it, but that's not easy to do. I mean, look at how fast it jumps out at you. Imagine if it didn't have a chain stuck on its body. You'd be screwed. And this is when it's restrained. That's just like a lampshade thought right there. This thing is actually stuck to that block and it's still causing me problems. Just imagine if it wasn't. Imagine if these things didn't get stuck to blocks. Mario would have no chance in hell. I guess duck jump just like the bare minimum and then land on him. Now then. Pipe! Got lucky there. Where was this guy? Ooh, okay. Shoots three. And then there's those. Yeah, we are in the Wiggler Desert after all. I don't know if I can use my shell to just take those things out. I know I don't want to land on any of them. It's not like I have a cape or anything, so I can't use that. My shell, is, my shell just seems to pass right through it. So I guess I just have to make sure I avoid landing on one. Well, now I have a cape. Which I can use to take guys out. If I don't lose the cape, that is. I'll just skip some level. Sure. Okay, good. 
We beat the level. Took a while, but we did it. And then there's Waterfall Panic. Welcome back with part 14. 